Hello, I'm Bema Gelson and I'm a teacher as well as I write for children. And today I'm going to be reading my book, Lam Chi Learns Quick, with my little friend here. My little friend, what's your name? Daisy Tenzin. Tlaeser Tenzin. Today we're going to read Lam Chi Learns Quick. All right, Lam Chi Learns Quick, and it's a book I'd written. Lam Chi is in Zonka. Okay, and in English, what do you, what would you say? An elephant. Yeah, an yeah. elephant, okay. Lam Chi is an elephant, all right. Now, yeah. Okay, Lam Chi had been napping the mm. afternoon away. A gentle tug on his ear, see? A gentle tug on his ear brought Lam Chi back from his daydream. It was his best friend, Nago. Who's Nago? Here, here's Nago. Nago's pulling Lam Chi, okay? He's sleeping. Yeah, Lam Chi's sleeping. But he doesn't have yellow hair. Only Lam Chi has yellow hair. Nago doesn't have. Lam Chi is special. I have found a new waterfall across the dry stream. Let's go and be back before our elders return, said Nago. Don't you think we should ask our parents, said Lam Chi. Lam Chi is a coward. Lam Chi is a coward. His friends started teasing him. To prove his friends wrong, he decided to go along with them. They spent the entire afternoon rolling in the mud, splashing water, chewing the soft grass and leaves. Nargo and Namchi are not stopping playing. Yes. Okay. So now we are going to make an elephant sound together, okay? Do you know how an elephant sound is? Ah! Louder, do louder. Ah! Yeah. What was that? What was that? Yes. Namchi was caught in a... A booby trap. Exactly. He was caught in a booby trap. Namchi looked into the bushes. <gasps> And he saw an elephant. And the elephant was caught in a trap. Oh, so sad, right? So who do you think put the elephant in the trap? Who put the elephant there? Humans, okay? Yep, humans yeah, put the elephant. Yeah, exactly. But what's a human? Oh, that's a good question. What's a human? What are you? What am I? Humans. Okay. okay. So now, turn the page. All right. Okay. Seeing the trapped elephant, a sudden chill ran down Lamchi's body. He remembered what his mother had told him of how humans tried to harm the elephants. Harm oh. the elephants. Exactly. <coughs> Lamchi cried out for help. The other elephants. Uh, small elephants, medium elephants, large elephants, largest elephants, and gigantic elephants. Exactly. The other elephants, hearing the call, came and quickly gathered around the elephant who had been trapped. After a while, they managed to pull him out to safety. So Namchi go in a booby trap and elephants are coming to rescue. Yes, exactly. And then Namchi hid behind the tall grasses in shame. He was feeling ashamed because he had gone without permission, okay? okay? He had not asked his parents. Suddenly he saw a shadow. Who was it? It was his mother, okay? And then his mother said to him, Son, always be very careful. This world is a very dangerous place. Why do you think it's a dangerous place? Because he went to a booby trap. Exactly. Good boy. Okay, tell you. This world is a dangerous place. Returning to the forest, they came across an old monastery covered by thick banana leaves. The elephants were curious. They went towards the old monastery and they looked inside. Okay, they looked inside. 
And what do you think they saw? What do you think they saw? What do you think? They saw this. Exactly. What, they saw, what is that? They saw a Buddha. He saw a shining golden Buddha. On both sides of the idol were two huge tusks, just like his own. Okay, Tilly? Where are the tusks? The tusks? two tusks. The elephant's tusk. Here, yeah, two sides. Exactly. It was taken from Lamche. Okay. Let's shall we turn the page? Okay, let's okay. turn out the page. Lamche stared at the tusk. He suddenly understood why it was dangerous for him and his friends to be alone in the forest. Slowly, tears rolled down his face. Why do you think Lamche is crying? He, he saw a tusk. Exactly. And he wished that humans would be kind to animals, that they would not harm animals. So they killed the elephant and they took the elephant's tusk. Yes, they are harming the animals. All right. As the herd walked home, okay, as all the elephants, the herd of elephants walked home, Lamchi felt a deep sadness. Deep sadness. Exactly. But he was also a lot wiser. He would never forget what he had seen in that old monastery. All right. Now, as we come to the end of our story, so, Tilly, let us all try to be kinder to animals, okay? Okay. Let's not hurt animals, all right? So, what do you think the Lamchi Learns Quick is about? Take care of pets and animals. Very good. Thank you, Tilly. Thank you. You enjoyed the story? Chapter.